Hello, Stephen. Welcome to TechEd. Thank you. Paul, the IT Grand Prix was a free conference event and it was all about helping our technical community give back to their civic communities. How many of you followed this? I had eight IT pros and developers who were also Microsoft certified professionals and Microsoft certified trainers. Amongst those eight people, they had over 200 certifications. And those eight people, they raced through four cities helping nonprofits along the way. They helped students, they helped uh, humanitarians, uh, they, had a, they had a bunch of creative challenges as well, and they were all competing for the right to award a $10,000 check to the charity of their So in just a minute, we're going to announce the winner, the winning team of the IT Grand Prix, but to help us announce the winner, I'm going to invite up a champion in his own right. Uh, I know he may not be the only technologist in the room. I know he's not the only Microsoft certified professional in the room, but I'm pretty sure I would wager anyway that he's the only Olympic gold medalist in the room. Would you please welcome Stephen Holcomb from the U.S. Olympic Cosplay? Yeah, thank you very much for having me. This is uh, an incredible experience so far, and it hasn't even started yet. So uh, I don't know. It's you know being a having my you know geek background is really cool to kind of make it to tech ed finally and be able to meet a lot of the trainers and the people and, and kind of see all the cool new stuff that's coming out. Now you know we have a testing center, are you going to take any exams this week? Uh, I thought about it, yeah. I mean, it's, uh, it's, it's here, why not? I think there's probably a lot of uh, MCTs on site that would love to help you prepare. Now it's time to announce the winner of the IT Grand Prix. We have four great teams who accomplished a lot of great work this past week. And uh, Stephen, as soon as you get your mic situated right there. I'm working. All right. All right. Would you uh, tell us who the winning team is? Well, uh, fortunately, I get to uh, announce the winning team, and we actually uh, have quite a bit in common. Um, so, so, here's my gold medal. Oh, is that the yeah, is that the medal? Yeah, so, uh, being gold medalist, um, I'd like to announce that the winning team was the gold team. Social and on the phone, that's because my teammate ran a half marathon this morning. And oh, and Chris says that's awesome, that's great. Hey, Susan, could you tell us a little bit about the nonprofit that you were competing for and who's going to get the $10,000 donation? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. The uh, organization that uh, Christopher and I chose to support was International Development Enterprises. Uh, the reason we chose them is we really love the, the all the, all the charities, honestly, it's fantastic. Uh, we chose them because of this sort of philosophy. You think about, you've all heard the expression, you give a man a fish, you feed him for a day. You teach a man to fish, you feed him for a lifetime. International Development Enterprises doesn't just teach a man to fish, he teaches him how to fish, gives him a boat and a fishing rod, shows him where to fish, what kind of fish he should catch, and how to sell them. And if you think about the kind of impact that has on a small community or a small family in a country which is having trouble with uh, aid and food and so on, just has a tremendous impact. And they can have a lot of impact with $500, so the fact that we just want $10,000 is just just phenomenal, and uh, you just so made our week. Well, thanks very much. This is what it looks like on me. 